there and welcome. My name is Miss Gett and I'm the principal of NL Dillard Middle School. And this is... I'm Mr. Garrett. I'm the assistant principal of NL Dillard Middle School and I'm over 7th and 8th grade. And this is... Hi, I'm Miss Castle and I'm assistant principal over 6th and 7th grade. Man, I'm a new 6th grader. I just got out of my car. What do I do? Well, follow me. Hey, Miss Castle. I'm a new 6th grader and I just got off the bus. Where do I go? Well, follow me. Okay. Hey, Miss Castle, where do I go now? Well, if you're a car rider, you're going to come across the courtyard. If you're a bus rider, you're going to come straight in and everybody's going to come through this one door by the cafeteria where it says, Use this door. Come in. Oh, wow. This is so cool. Wow, Miss Castle, I heard that when we come in, we go somewhere like the cafeteria? That's right. All 6th graders are going to the cafeteria. Follow me and I'll show you the cafeteria. Woo! That was a really good breakfast, Miss Castle. Where do I go now? Well, now it's time to go to the 6th grade hall. Follow me. All right. What's this area called? This is the gym lobby. Oh, wow. We have a gym lobby. So back there is the gym. There's the gym. Cool. All right. Where are we going back to? My hall? 6th grade hall. Okay. Wow, these look like bathrooms. Is this where we go to the bathroom? Definitely. We have the women on one side and the men on the other. Oh, okay. Well, where are the classrooms? Down here. Follow me. Oh, okay. These are our science labs down here. Oh, okay. Cool. Do I stay with one teacher all day long, Miss Cassie? Hey, Mr. Betsy, no. You're going to have different teachers throughout the day. Different teachers? Different teachers. She's Louise. Oh, man. These are the locker bays. Oh, wow. We have lockers? We have lockers. Ooh. Your teacher will assign you a locker and give you a combination and help you practice that combination. We So I have to know a combination to get into to, this? You have to know your combination. Do I have to remember it every day? Yes, you do. Oh, this man. This is why you're going to practice it with your teacher and then by yourself. I'm going to be a pro at this. Don't you worry. I can do it, Miss Castle. Good. All right. Hey, there's a whole lot of classrooms around here. You told me that I had a science teacher. How many other teachers do I have? Well, over here you've got a math room. So you've got a math teacher. Whoa, boy. Mm. Who's that? That is also your science, too. This oh, is science man. Two. That one up there was for the lab, and this is for science work here. Oh, wow. What's over here? Over here. Look over here. You've got a social studies. Oh, wow. And then what's over there? There is ELA. Wow, what does ELA stand for? English Language Arts. Wow, so already I know I have a math teacher, a science teacher, a social studies teacher, and an English Language Arts teacher. Yes. That's four whole teachers. And I got a locker. Man, I got a lot to learn. Hey, so Ms. Castle, you told me I had math, science, language, arts, and then that social studies class for all those teachers. Hey, is it time to go home? Do I go get on my bus? Not yet, Miss Gann. Oh, We've got man. a couple of more classes. Let's go see them. Okay. Woo. Hey, what's that room? That's ISS. That's where Miss Gann's not ever going to be. Oh, that's right, because I'm a good kid, so I don't get an ISS. Because if you break school rules, you end up in there, and that is not a nice place to be. Okay, I'm going to stay away from that room. On this hall too. There are a few. You have Mr. Fox who is an IT. You may need to see him if your Chromebook's not working. Okay, so if my Chromebook doesn't work, and then who are these other people? Well, we've got Miss Miller, and we've got Miss Minton. Wow, we've got Miss McCandies. These are some cool classes down here. So if you have some of these teachers, these could be some cool classes to be in as well, huh? Yeah. Okay. Lots of fun going up. Lots of fun. I'm excited. Whoa! Here's another big intersection. Look, up there it says 8th grade. Up there it says 7th grade. Do I go on those halls? 
You should not have to go on those halls. Oh, wow. Okay, because I'm a sixth grader. Right. But that one says career explorations. Are we heading there? That's where we're going. Whoa! Let's go explore some careers. So, Miss Dan, you've got some career classes down here on this hall. Wow. I want to have a career one day. I hope you do. Yeah, I hope I do too. So, I can go to this class, and then there's a class over here, it looks like. That's a whole other class we can go to? That's two. Wow, so are these all, once I go to these, this hall, then that's it, right? I can go get on my bus? Not yet. Oh, man, where are we going now, Miss Castle? Let's see some more classes you might have. Okay, let's go. Miss Castle, I'm already tired. This is a lot of walking. How far do we have to go to get to my other places? You've got to go all the way down there. All the way. Whoa, that's a long way. All right, Miss Castle. You said we were going to my next classes, but right here is we're back in that gym thing, that gym lobby thing you said. So what are we doing way over here other than maybe getting a sip of water? So Miss Gant, on the other side of the gym lobby is band. So if you have band, you'll be coming down here. Oh, is there any other class down there? There are the health rooms down there. Oh, ooh, health? We learned about health. Yes, ma'am. I like being healthy. Maybe you can't tell right now, but I like being healthy. Where are we going now, Miss Castle? I'm going to show you the gym. Whoa! This is not like elementary school. What is this? This is the gym, Miss Gant. This is where you're going to meet for PE. Wow! We can put like all the schools in the whole district in here. This place is huge. And we do meet in here sometimes for the whole school for different activities. Wow! I love this, Miss Castle. So, that's pretty much it. After this, do I go home? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, so what do I go home and do? Let's go see. come to the gym lobby and exit the same doors you come in in the morning to catch your bus. Woo! If that's you're good. you're first load. First load? How do I know I'm first load? Your teachers are going to tell you, but if you're a second load, you'll wait in the cafeteria until your bus pulls up. Wow, so does it work like that every single day? Yes, it does. And there's every never any bus day. changes? I sometimes always ride are, those buses? Sometimes there are bus changes. You may ride, have to ride a different bus if one breaks down, and if you do, we have a board to tell you exactly what bus you will be riding if there is a bus change. Oh, that's pretty nifty. So when you come through the doors, the first thing you need to do is check that sign before you go to get on the bus. Cool. Hey, so Miss Castle, sometimes I don't ride the bus, and sometimes I ride in a car. How do I get out of here if I'm not riding on the bus? Well, if you're going to ride a car at the end of the day, you're going to come down the sixth grade hall and you're going to go straight out the main doors and wait oh, for your ride. There's main doors. I didn't know we had main doors. I thought those were the main doors down here. So this is the main way to get into the building. Yes. Oh, All wow. All the doors come in this way. Wow. Okay. Wow. This is like what they call a vestibule? Yes. I thought they were called vegetables. Ha, <laughs> ha, Vestibule. Vegetable. All right, wow, these are the main doors. What's that place? That's the office. Let's go look. Wow. Oh, so normally this is like where the lady sits mm -hmm. and I can talk to her and like tell her stuff and then she tells me stuff, right. like how to get to places or write passes and stuff. Right, and this is where you're gonna come if you need to see someone in the office. Plus the nurse is located right behind there. So this is where you'll come to see the nurse. Oh, pretty cool. This is a big old office. Well, let's look some more because you may need to see someone else. Oh, no. So, if you come down this hall, this first door is my office if you need to see me. For good stuff only. Good stuff. Then we come to Mr. Garrett's office. For good stuff only. Then we come to Miss Gant's office, the principal. Oh, that would be me. But only good stuff in my office, too. What else is back here? We've got guidance. Come on and look. So if you need to see a guidance counselor, both of their offices are located right here. We got two whole guidance counselors? Two. You get They're it? always here? They're always here. I need to talk to them right now. Are they here now? They're not here now. 
Oh, just not it's right now, but they're always here during school hours. Can I help you? Yes, you can. Okay. Thank you. Well, Miss Gant, what do you think this is? This looks like La Bibliothèque or the library, man. This place is huge. This is right across from the office. Look at all the books in here. Hey, is there a library lady that works in here too? There is, Miss Meyer. She's, she's, is she pretty cool? She's, you're gonna love Miss Meyer. Oh, I can't wait to come read books in here and see Miss Miner in the library. Hey, I heard that there's a rumor that if you stand in the middle of it, it makes an egg go, oh, oh. That's true. That's really cool. Wow, lots of different seating in here. Look at all these cool projects that people did. We put projects on display in here? Yes, we do. Wow, look at all those. Hey, do we get computers here? You will, everyone will get a Chromebook here. Wow, because we're one to one. But you have to take care of it. Oh, I promise to take care of my Chromebook, Miss Castle. I'm very careful. Wow, gotta unplug them before we take them. Oh, wow, there's some rules to these Chromebooks. Yes, ma'am, you're gonna sign them for those rules too, saying you understand them. Okay, it's my responsibility. Yes, it is. I've got to be very responsible when I become a middle schooler. Oh, no, Miss Castle. I think I just heard a bell. I think I gotta go. Remember, I'm a car rider today. Oh, yes, you better go. Okay. Come yeah. On. Come on. Where do I go? Do I go out the front of here? You do. Oh wait, there's my mom. Hey, Miss Castle. I'll see you later. It was really fun at school today. Okay. Bye. I know we're socially distancing, so can I do an elbow bump with you? awesome it was so fun but on a serious note when you come to middle school things are very different than when they are in elementary school so we just want to give you a couple of reminders kind of be a little serious now and remind you of what we really expect out of you every single day when you come to middle school so miss castle what are some things that you think that kids should be reminded of well we are going to have fun but you're also going to have a lot of work to do so when you're on your hall and in your classes you need to be sure you're attending to your work in your class when you transition to a different class, you need to go straight to that class. You need to adhere to your times for your restroom schedules. You need to adhere to the times for your lockers. So you need to be on top of everything every day and making sure you're getting all your work done and getting all your homework completed and turned in. I agree. Mr. Garrett? I think overall kids just make sure that you're following rules and expectations. Um, listen to your teachers. Listen to what the administrators tell you. And above all, remember this, we're having fun, but we ain't playing. Never. So this is Miss Gant, Miss Castle, Mr. Garrett. We're the admin team here at Dillard. We really want to welcome you to such a wonderful school. We hope you have a wonderful experience. And this all was done for you so that hopefully you learned a little bit about the school while we're still kind of out during this period. But we can't wait to have you back in this building next year, ready to learn. Remember, like Mr. Gary said, we are always going to have fun. But ain't nobody playing. If you ever see this face right here, you know that we are done playing. All right? But we won't see that face because we're going to have a great year. Have a great year, everybody. Have a great year. Have a great year. Thanks, guys. See you when Bye. you get here.